Hi, I'm Miss Wendy and welcome to the Great Composers program. This month I'd like to introduce you to Peter Tchaikovsky. He was born in 1840 and he lived until 1893. He was born and died in Russia and he was a Romantic era composer and pianist. <laughs> When he was five, he began to learn the piano. His dad encouraged him to receive an education as a minister of justice, although he did encourage him also to continue his music studies. When his mom died, he turned to music, and he was 14 at the time and dealing with a lot of confusing feelings of loss and grief. And so he decided to write a waltz in his mom's memory. He was a pioneer in Russian music and believed that all of his music belonged to the world, not just to Russia. One of Tchaikovsky's most famous pieces of music is the Nutcracker Suite. It is beloved above all of his music, and it is a wonderful Christmas tradition. The Nutcracker Suite was composed in 1892, just a year before he died. A suite is actually a set of songs that are related, and so that is why it's called the Nutcracker Suite. There are eight songs in this suite. It was performed first in March 1892. It was so popular that they created a, a ballet around the songs and he created more music for the ballet. That was performed in 1892 in December. However, that was not as popular until Balanchine created his choreography and now it is a worldwide tradition at Christmas. There are eight songs included in the Nutcracker Suite, the Overture, the March, Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairy, Tree Pack or Russian Dance, Arabian Dance, the Chinese Dance, Reed Flutes, and Waltz of the Flowers. For your listening activity, I want you to use three of those songs to listen to, write the words, or draw pictures to describe your listening experience. As I mentioned earlier, Peter lost his mom when he was 14. He was overcome with a lot of complicated feelings of grief and, and loss, and so he turned to music and he wrote a waltz in her memory. That is when music became his friend to help him deal with a lot of the complicated emotions he felt. Another one of Tchaikovsky's most famous pieces is the theme from 1812 Overture. Often great music can be reused to create new songs. Listen carefully. Can you guess which pop song uses the theme from 1812? <laughs> Comment below with your best guess. Thanks for joining Learn Play Love with Miss Wendy. See you next month. Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays.